Well, hello everybody, and today we are in the Winter Wonderland. You know that I said the other day that uh, Wendy's got a Fitbit, and I was so impressed with it, I thought I'd buy my own, and it's arrived today. Here it is. So it's from Amazon. I've not undone the box yet. So you'll see in the unboxing of Steve's Fitbit live. Well, it's not live, but on camera now. So here we go. Here it is. So Amazon box, got that away. It comes in a plastic bag, which I don't know. I don't know why it comes in a plastic bag because it's in quite a sturdy box, like this. Um, and it's it's actually is black. Now Wendy's box has the um, colour of the band on it, and it's it's not immediately obvious, but because I've opened one before, I know how to do it. Um, yeah, there's a little tag on the back there that undoes that little um, sort of sticky band there. It's not really that sticky, and then the outer cover pulls off. We like to save the boxes for about two or three years or five years and then we get so fed up with them that we throw them out. <laughs> I don't know why we don't throw the boxes out straight away. And then you get the box, the inner box with Fitbit written on it and that opens up like so to reveal ah, the Fitbit itself. So there's a little, it's very um, Apple inspired, I think, this packaging. They, they do, the, the packaging's done very well indeed. Now here is the Fitbit. There's a little tag there that you can pull that out. And uh, you pull that off, pull that off of there. It's a sort of a, a, sc a screen, that, that's what it might look like. But it doesn't come charged. So, and you have to, you can't actually use it right out of the box. You can't use it at all. You can put it on, do what you like with it, but it's useless until you've registered it with, um, with the Fitbit people. Now, I, I haven't worn a watch for years, and I think... I think I used to wear my watch on my left wrist. I think that's right. So, and that's the way this will go. Um, around there. Well, it's actually got a nice little... I don't know if you can see that. There's a nice little sort of tag inside the, the band um, thing there. I think it looks, it looks quite nice, uh, quite comfortable. Um, and then what you've got also, you've got these instructions. Um, it says go, well, the only instruction you need really is on the front of there, which is um, fitbit.com forward slash setup. So that's what I'm going to do now. I'll be back in a moment. So that's the main setup of the Fitbit 2 done. Um, I've got it on charge and it's running through. It says it takes about 10 minutes. Um, when we did that to Wend for Wendy's one, it took 
like two or three minutes so I'm just going to leave it running but while I'm doing that I'll show you what else is in the box I'm using Wendy's charger <laughs> to charge mine up so this is this is the box it comes in and you get the instructions here so you get this little instruction pack and a lot of things you know little tiny tiny instructions and stuff like that and the, the tiniest of tiny tiny books with you know but I mean you know what I do with that it usually gets thrown away or cast aside and I can't I can't believe I'll ever look at that again ever but there is um, in here in here there's a little tag there it's quite difficult to get a hold of but then you pull that box out that leaves the box empty so you've got the Fitbit the instruction pack and this little box that contains a charger which again that little um, bit comes off and then you open it up and here it is now it's a standard it's a standard USB plug at one end so standard USB at that end and then it's got this little sort of almost bulldog clip type thing where your Fitbit fit sits inside that and connects on to these little contacts here um, while that's in USB so you know we've got loads of USB plugs and um, so you know mine's on charge up there with connected to one of these but that's what you get in the box so none of none of this is now needed so you know we could just chuck it all back in the box put the box away you've got that and I think unless unless there's something fundamentally wrong with it um, we won't ever need to see or use that box again um, but I think yeah you know, I I think what I'm going to do is give you another bit of an update on that, uh, on how it's working in maybe a couple of days time when I've worn it uh, and see how, maybe we can see how, um, you know, how many steps I'm doing, my heart rate, my sleep patterns and stuff like that and uh, show you that type of stuff and then how I'm reacting to that. Because it, you know, it's important to to sort of know, you know, whether whether you've got some issues going on, and then to choose whether to do something about it. But that's the Fitbit in all its glory. Um, I'm keen to uh, go and see if it's set up and uh, and working. So.